Right, to royal matters, much more sensible matters, and the first yet commissioned portrait of King Charles since taking the throne has been revealed this week. Yeah, I love all these, you know. I don't know what, I just like these sort of things, pictures that you can tell what they are. Painted in oils by Alistair Barford, it's a personal and intimate image of His Majesty, uh, showing him in a suit rather than ceremonial robes. I'm very pleased to say we're joined by the man himself, the painter, not the king, that is. <laughs> Alistair, welcome to the programme. And look, I know you were really keen to try and capture the sensitivity of the king. And look, to my... I mean, I'm no art critic, but it certainly seems to me as though you really nailed that. He looks so warm and sort of grandfatherly and approachable, but also still regal. I, I think it's wonderful. Well, thank you. <laughs> I mean, how do you set about trying to make somebody look sensitive? Um, I, 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 I don't know. I think <laughs> I, so the, my um, way of working is really, uh, tends to be, and it wasn't in this instant working from life. And when you work from life, you spend a sort of a lot of time with the person. And over the course of that time, you try to, I think, capture those 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 best fleeting moments so the resultant portrait may be something that never quite existed as a single moment like as in a photograph but is a synthesis of all those moments mm -hmm. and i think with this i was looking at an awful lot of different images ones that i had taken ones that other people have taken um in order to try and and convey something of that um because I, it, it's funny. I think when you're when you're working on a portrait, even when you're working at a distance, as I as I was with this, you develop a sort of uh, a relationship with 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 the person, and and then you just try to convey that however best you can. Well, I think you've done it marvelously, to be honest. I think there's, there's, there is, as Isabel says, there's something very warm and approachable yeah. about uh, uh, approachable about it. But why did you why did you get commissioned for this? What, what do you know anything about the decision process behind you being picked? Yeah, well, there's a there's a few reasons. One is I received a scholarship from the Queen Elizabeth scholarship trust um king charles was formerly a patron of this it's a scholarship that is set up to pre preserve british craftsmanship and it funded my first year of training um in portrait painting in italy um and the illustrated london news who commissioned me have produced a publication called the illustrated coronation i think for every copy that is sold um a donation will be made to quest so it's it's raising money to help other people benefit as i did from 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 quest's incredible support and i see you're speaking to us uh, from Froome this morning i know it well and it's actually renowned isn't it for craftsmanship for artisans as well um and lots of artists in and around that beautiful corner of somerset um you said that you didn't necessarily do sort of um seated painting sessions with the king for this but have you met him during all of this and, and where and and you know what's his response been to the well, portrait i didn't really meet him i was invited to buckingham palace to um, it was a biodiversity event, and I was in the king's presence for probably about an hour and a half um, as he was meeting and greeting and interacting with um, various um, representatives from biodiversity and, 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 and sustainability projects. Um, and that was, that was the access that I had. Mm. Um, May I ask you, Alex, quite... sorry, sorry to interrupt, um, you seem young. I don't know if you're younger than his own sons, but, I mean, it's quite a coup to, to have got the first portrait, isn't it? It's, yes, it's slightly overwhelming. <laughs> <laughs> well, the, to be, I tell you what, what a nice way to be overwhelmed, though, by something which, you know, ultimately will go down in history. You know, the, the, the first commission picture will forever be by you. Yeah, it, um, it's yes, it is very. It's it's a it's a huge honour. And as I say, I'm um, through through the king's patronage, through Quest, and also at the. I spent some time 
at the it was then the prince's drawing school it's now the royal drawing school so it's it's lovely to be um associated in this way because actually through his patronage and through his projects i've been given opportunities that i i i would never <laughs> never otherwise have received including painting the 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 king and and uh, a few years ago, the Queen as well. So. Well, in my <laughs> humble opinion, very well deserved. Um, Alistair Barford, fascinating talking mm. to you, and goodness knows what the future holds. Oh. <laughs> I wonder, this is the best PR you could ever hope for, isn't it? Painting the king like this. Uh, really good to see you this morning. Also, thank you Stephen much, would love you. a portrait. Oh, I'd love one, thank market. you. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, he's got the blue suit, hasn't he? Have you got any wrist uh, Amazonian tribal wristbands on? I've got a... Oh, anything, anything you like. You a bit of gold, bit of bling. Yeah. A bit of bling. I've always got the bling. There you on. go, um, Alistair. Thanks. Good to talk to you. Thank you. I say, I, do you, you know? What? I just think it is such a skill to be able to do that, and and even the the we get some abstracty stuff as well, which yeah. is an incredible skill. But with something like that, which is that real life, and you can really see the almost the the feeling in his face. I mean, I just think it's remarkable. Oh, are, you an art, are you an arty person? No, I'm not an arty person at all. I'm just showing you a portrait that my uh, father once painted of me. I don't oh. know, I'm have to get that on screen. That was me when I was a baby. It's a, I mean, that's interesting. That's the only portrait I've ever had done. That's me drinking from a baby's bottle. Where's camera three now? It's... it's, it's that was me. It's interesting, that. <laughs> it does look just like me, actually. I think he's going to get a commission to paint the king. Well, you never know. You never know. You might be watching. It's not as bad as it looks on camera. <laughs> so Put it that cheeky. way. Apologies, Mr. Webster. <laughs> um, but anyway, there you go. It's all right. It's very good. It's but perhaps right. not as good as Alistair's. Right, we're going to take a quick break. Oh, are we? Are we? Oh, uh, yes, and after that, we'll be talking about the newspapers. We've got Sean oh, and Liz smashing. back for that. <laughs> 